Alrighty guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Ryan, you're watching the Nighthawk Bros, and if you love Dangerous Freedom, go ahead and subscribe. So, today we're going to take a look at the Lone Wolf Distributors LTD-19. This is a Glock-ish pistol. I don't know. We're just going to do an unboxing today, and a basic overview, nothing too crazy. I have not had a chance to get this to the range to shoot it, but I figured I wanted to open the box up and kind of see what was going on. Oh, throwing this out there. Bravo Concealment Glock 19 holster. Works amazing. I was running around like an idiot for a couple days. Uh, just seeing if I could get it to fall out or do anything weird and it held up. So really good holster for the money. Really neat pistol for the money too. 699 to 650. This is the V2. So the package decided it wanted to just throw everything everywhere. So let's start there. Here we've got sticker, your owner's manual. And actually I did page through this owner's manual earlier and I gotta say there's some really good troubleshooting stuff in the back so hats off to you guys. I, I think that's that's neat in case anything ever happens. Obviously like anything you're gonna get a gun lock, PVC patch, we love those. Let's get to the meat and potatoes. Alright, so this is the gray and silver V2. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Slide serrations, lightning cuts up here. Uh, it's absolutely amazing. I, I love the slide serrations up front. That is, that is sick. So we'll talk a little bit more about the pistol in a sec. I just want to go through what's in the box yet. One Glock 19 mag. Uh, wish I would have got two mags. Would have been awesome, but it is what it is. And we also get a back strap, a little bit of a, a hump in it. So there's no specifications, nothing, nothing on here about the back strap. So I'm assuming it's just more of a, get kind of a different cant out of the pistol. Cause right now the way it's sitting, kind of a straight purchase on the pistol, very American, very 1911-esque. Uh, so this is one of those Glock, not Glock. Lone Wolf's been manufacturing aftermarket Glock parts. Uh, so you guys can kit out, mod out your, uh, your Glock since as long as I can remember. So it was about time that they do their own pistol, which is exactly what they did. And then they just basically threw one of their awesome slides on a, one of their one of their frames and this was born. All right, let's dive into a brief overview of the pistol. Starting with the weight, the pistol itself weighs in at an astonishing 19 ounces. Now that's without the magazine. Barrel length comes in at four inches. This is similar to your Glock 19, so that makes sense. I will be swapping out for a threaded barrel in the coming weeks. Sight radius comes in at 5.9 inches. Trigger pull comes in at 6.5 pounds. It's not the best trigger in the world. It takes a little bit of getting used to, but I think with a little bit of practice, I'm going to absolutely love this pistol. So basically what you're looking at is a Timberwolf frame with a more of a, well, with more of a 1911 style grip angle. So instead of having that slight cant like you would have with a, a traditional Glock 19, you're going to have something a little bit straighter. I personally like it. It's very American. Uh, I'm sure some of the Glock fanboys, I don't know if they would really like this pistol. I've never been a huge fan. I've owned two Glocks and I got to say like, I would prefer this over the Glock 19 any day. I did, however, really like the Glock 19X. That was a really cool pistol. So because this is similar to the Glock 19, uh, things like your magazine is going to be compatible. Factory mags obviously come to the factory mags, so you can use uh, Glock 19 mags. Another great thing is your holsters. You know, you can actually run uh, a Glock 19 holster. I went with Bravo Concealment's holster. It actually works outstanding. I think these two make a great combination together. So just keep that in mind. You can actually pick them up on Amazon Prime. So you get Prime shipping, which is pretty cool too. So uh, I don't have any uh, type of affiliation with uh, either company. I just wanted to, to throw that out there that it's a, it's a great combo. All right, guys, that'll about wrap it up. Gotta say, this thing's gonna be mad fun. I I think it's great for the price. You're getting a, a lot of bang for your buck. So hoping it performs on the range test. We will check back in with that. 
Like I said, I want to get a threaded barrel for this for sure. I'd love to run it suppressed. It would definitely up my Instagram game, if you know what I'm saying. But uh, putting all of that aside, guys, just remember this channel, we focus a lot on firearms and crypto. And if you like both of those things, like I said, please subscribe. I will catch you on the next one.